Are you ready? Can you say soccer? Soccer! Boom! Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your boy Drew here. Today, I'm going to give you guys a little quick um, jersey haul. I'm going to show you guys all my jerseys that I have of every team that I have. There's not many, there's just a lot of one certain team. But, yeah. Anyway, so that's. That's what this video is going to be about. I know you guys, some of you guys have requested me to make this kind of video. Please don't touch that. Um, anyway, so without further ado, let's get to it. Say bye to them. Bye. Cool. Good job. That's it. You did it. Okay, so anyway, the first jersey that I ever got when I got like back into soccer, like I used to be, like be obsessed with soccer and like I went through like a little like teenage angsty phase where I was like, oh, that's dumb. I don't care about that. Let me just play stupid video games or whatever. Like, and I regret it because I could have been like famous. No, not really. But I regret like just falling out of love with soccer. But then when I came back in love with soccer, when I fell back in love with soccer, I got this was my first jersey I ever got it was for Christmas, and it was how cliche a Barca jersey. This was my favorite Barca jersey ever. No Barca jersey before or after this compared to this one, at least to me. Um, in the back, because I thought I'd play for them one day, and I'm done. And 23 is, my, 23 is my favorite number, so that's why I put 23. But it's very, I hold it very dear to me because they won the treble this year, and I was just like, this is like the best thing ever. I love this. Uh, what's next? Obviously, obviously we got Peru here. I gotta rep my Peru brothers, my my native country. Um, Guerrero's the best number nine for Peru, besides Claudio Pizarro, but I think Guerrero's a little better. Um, so that's that. And also, you guys notice like there's no green screen effect. It's only because like I don't know what, if these jersey colors are gonna mess it up from bringing in like new color jerseys to the camera. I don't mess up, but whatever. Uh, what, what do we got next? We got this beautiful. This this is the latest jersey I've gotten so far. It's a Liverpool jersey. I think it was 2017-2018 year uh, season. Uh, no name on the back because I was like, you know what? I don't need a name on the back because if I get a name. My luck, this player we're gonna leave, and I'm, I'm gonna have a, a player's name here that doesn't play for the club anymore, and I hate that. So now I just go with no name jerseys. I think that's like my new thing. So there's that. You know, I wore this one. I've got this like last year. I wore it like every day, every chance I could, every game I watched for Liverpool, I, I wore it. So I love this jersey. What do we got next? <sighs> I gotta catch my breath because uh, carry my nephew back to his mom, my sister. Out of breath, and I've asked him. So, you can, as you can imagine, I'm out of breath. Um, so, anyway, next, uh, not video, next shirt. Obviously, we got this other Barcelona jersey because I'm such a freaking bandwagoner. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Uh, I don't know. But anyway, I, go, I this is actually my second favorite design for the Barcelona jerseys because I like the darker color. I like the two blue stripes. The only thing I don't like is this sponsor that's just like, I don't know, whatever. But I love this little um, Barcelona little strip here. I forget what it's called. I forget. I'm such an in like Blaugrana. Um, what do they call? I'm like blanking right now. But I know what this means, okay? I know. All right, Barca fans. Um, the back UNICEF looks cool. That little Barca thing here. Beautiful. What a beautiful jersey. Oh. <laughs> Next up for jerseys is we got this beautiful... You gotta have a, if you're a USA uh, video or YouTuber or USA fan of soccer, you gotta have at least one USA jersey. And that's mine right here. This one, it's too small on me now, so I'm, I'm due for a new one because I've been here in the gym. <laughs> I'm such a loser. Um, but yeah, I've, I've, this was my first USA jersey and my only one, unfortunately, but I'm gonna get more. Um, I like the one, the plain white one. That's the thing, that's the one I'm gonna get next because it's on sale, so why not? Um, no name on the back, of course, because why do we need a name on there? It's me. I'm repping. I'm I'm repping USA. But I love it. I love this. It reminds me of like those old um, popsicles, those icicles, like the rocket ones. It was like red, white, and blue. It was like a popsicle. But Th that's just what I think about when I see this. So that's that. Next up, we got probably one of my favorite like uh, attires or merch for uh, soccer teams. And this one's not really a jersey. It's like more of a little jacket, a little uh, tracksuit jacket. It says Liverpool FC at the back. Looks beautiful on camera, especially with this lighting. Wow. Um, the front, it's just like a little regular zip up uh, red hoodie. Love the, the beautiful LFC 100 year anniversary bird here. 
I love these white and red stripes, the bottom too. I was just wow, I wore it literally with the jersey every day when I got them. Um, this was really expensive too, but it was worth it. I don't care if I went negative in my account, it was worth it. But if I have a Liverpool jersey, you know I gotta have a USA one. And this one I got in 2014 for the 2014 World Cup. The weirdest place I got it, I, you guys are not gonna believe it. I got it at PacSun in the mall in like King of Prussia in uh, Pennsylvania. Um, so first of all, I didn't know PacSun was gonna sell any World Cup related stuff. And if you guys don't know what PacSun is, I'm sure a lot of you do, but if you don't, it's just like a, a clothing store. Like it used to be like really skater, surfer store. Now it's just like trendy. I don't know. I don't go there anymore. But I got this back then and I loved it. I wore this, of course, every day that summer, even though it was fucking blazing hot. It was also expensive. And you would think it'd be like, cheaper because it was hot. It was summer and like they were trying like jackets, but PacSun don't care. So this old USA crest here, uh, loved it, so vintage. Uh, Nike, of course, love it, love it. And the last thing I got is nothing really crazy, it's just like a Barcelona sweater, sweatshirt. One thing I love is I love hoodies. Love this little strip here, but hoodies are my favorite things to wear. Definitely would go to get more uh, soccer hoodies because they're my favorite things. I love soccer, I love hoodies, so put them two and two together, and that's that. Uh, I think that's all I got. I got another Peru jersey somewhere, a white one, but not with me. I think it's at my dad's house or somewhere in Jersey or my car, but I have it. So it's the same thing. It's just good right on the back. It's just like a uh, white shirt, blue, uh, red stripe down here, diagonal wise. Um, Oh, I thought my mic was off. I was gonna be like, I could do this whole thing over again, but whatever. So there you go, guys. That was a random, kind of like off topic of MLS video, but I uh, showed you guys my jersey haul. Let me know, you guys, what kind of jerseys you guys have, what kind of jerseys you guys want to get. I know I'm due for an MLS jersey. I have an MLS YouTuber. I don't have an MLS jersey, but I'm gonna get some Philly, Delphia, Union jerseys um, because my Philly boys, right? Come on. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. If you guys love. US, US soccer and soccer in America and you guys want to see it grow in this country hit that, subs hit that subscribe button and be part of the change I'll see you guys next time